Welcome back. We are here on Ethereum looking at the uh, indices, and this is going to be my daily forecast for Wednesday, April 28, 2021. If you like to support our channel, you're welcome to hit the subscribe button down here in the corner, hit the like button and the bell button to see our newest videos, and you're welcome to follow our trades over here at Ethereum. The link is down below. So let's look at the SP 500, and as you can see, nothing really has happened today. So we have been um, pulling back and forwards, but really nothing really has happened compared to the last uh, last three trading days we've just been trading sideways you can also see that on the technical indicators they are technically very flat at this current stage but we are on the edge of being overbought so a pullback towards the 20 exponential that has offered support in the past break below that will uh, move this towards the bottom of the bullish band or the 50 moving average down here at the 4000 but uh, at this current stage Pull back towards the 20 will most likely offer a massive support. Long term target here will be to the 4,250 or 2,500. So let's look at the Dow Jones. Same here for the Dow Jones. We are in a little bit of a downtrend the last three trading days. Technical indicators have all turned around and are fairly bearish at this point. So the 20 exponential has also offered support in the past. We can see it right here and also over here and also way back. It has basically bouncing, been bouncing off the 20 exponential. There have been occasions where this has broken, the 20 exponential have bro broken and then we'll head towards the 50 moving average down here at 32,792. Otherwise, technical indicators are pointing to uh, downwards momentum so we could see this fall even further uh, long-term target here will most likely be 35,000 if this channel continues to uh, rally as it has been so let's look at the Nasdaq so the Nasdaq has a pullback a bit and um, this is probably not to due to earnings because uh, earnings for major stock uh, tech companies has been amazing even those uh, for uh, Nasdaq, for the, um, for my, Microsoft and and Google, and also for Tesla, they have actually been uh, really good. But uh, it is getting fairly overstretched. We have basically been rallying from the very bottom here at twelve thousand two hundred, and now we're trading at uh, roughly fourteen thousand. So a pullback should be expected, and uh, we are technically just trading sideways. We'll have the twenty exponential moving this way, so we could trade into trend in towards the 20 exponential and then go higher 40,000 and 40,000 14,000 and uh, 500 and 15,000 will most likely be the target the next few months technical indicators are fairly flat at this current stage and the break below the 20 exponential could open the door to the 50 moving average which is down here at 13,300 give or take and also the previous uh, resistant area here so let's look at the German DAX and as you can see, we have pulled back a little bit. Uh, nothing has really happened here in the DAX the last four trading days. And that could be seen as a bullish shine as we are not breaking below the 20 exponential. If we were to break below the 20 exponential, that could open the door to the 50 moving average down here at 14,656. Technical indicators are fairly bearish. So it is technically a waiting game. We could also bounce from here and head towards 15,500 or 16,000. But at that is basically to be seen. Technically, as I said, all of them are fairly bearish at this point. So let's look at the UK 100. So UK 100 has a pullback a little bit from yesterday's rally. And technically, are, well, they're all flat at this current stage. So we could continue this rally and most likely find resistance up here at 7,040. Uh, if we pull back from here, we'll most likely find support at 6,890. Uh, 6, if that basically breaks, we could drop towards the 50 moving average down here at 6,770. So there is basically also a waiting game, but technically what happens here. Pullbacks have been bought into, as we can see right here and also here. We basically pullbacks towards the 20 exponential were the catalyst to these rallies right here. So let's look at the China 50. So as you can see, we have pulled back yet again. Um, so it looks like rallying up towards the 50 moving average or basically the top of the bullish band 
well, that means that we're going to sell off. And uh, we're still in the middle of nowhere. It is a complete gamble at this current stage to guess where we are going with this. A break above the 50, well, that could open the door to 19,000, even 20,000. Break below the 20, uh, 200 moving average, we could open the door to 16 and and probably 15,000. But at this current stage, technical indicators are all over the place and um, this indice is also kind of all over the place. So it is a waiting game. So hope you found this helpful. You're welcome to support our channel by subscribing, hit the like button and the bell button to see our newest videos and you're welcome to follow us here over at Etero. The link is down below. Good luck and thank you very much.